fine. How are you? Thank you. <laughs> I'm warm. <laughs> I am happy that this movie is finally coming out. I remember when I was cast, I was a little confused because I thought like, oh, but if there's a superhero, how come he's protected by women, you know? So I had to do my research and I, I realized, oh, I actually like this. I haven't seen that in, in movies before, that a lot of these women can be so strong. All the women, not just the Dora Milaje, you know, also the other leaders, the, the mother, um, royal mother. and and. This is something that we haven't had before, so I wish that also young girls maybe come out and say like, wow, I want to be a Dora, you know, like, yeah. And what, what did you learn from the Dora? I mean, I anyway have a dance background and I do martial arts, so for me, learning skills with other women, that is nothing new, but again, the characters they serve, you know, and when you play a character like that, um, it had to do, you, you, it needs a lot of discipline. It's not a glamorous part, you know, because we go in, we have to fight, um, you put yourself into dangerous situations, and to be allowed to do that and having a team that trusts you to do that, I think that is amazing, you know, like it makes you strong. I was born in Uganda, East Africa, and I grew up in Germany. Well, I, I think in general, I mean, it doesn't matter, if I'm from Uganda, then we have Lupita from Kenya, we have Danai from Zimbabwe, it doesn't matter which country you're from in Africa, I think just having a whole movie with a lot of people of color, that already helps, you know, for a lot, not just America, but also Africa, where people can say, oh my gosh, there's finally a movie about us, and we're not the victims.